In today's video, I'll be sharing with you a step-by-step -step guide on how to transfer your WhatsApp data from Android to iPhone or iPhone to Android. As WhatsApp is one of the most popular messaging application in the world and if you are planning to switch from Android to iPhone or iPhone to Android, you might be worried about losing your precious chats photos and videos. But fear not because in this video, I will be showing you how to safely and easily transfer all your WhatsApp data to your new iPhone without losing a single byte. So whether if you are a seasoned WhatsApp user or a newbie, this video is for you. Without wasting any time, let's dive in and get your WhatsApp data transfer to your iPhone in no time. What's up guys, this is Mehran from Dynamic Tech and without wasting any time, First of all, you have to download i2lib What's Go application to your desktop which is compatible with iOS 16 and Android 13. The i2lib is also offering a lot of features for Android and iPhone users such as you can transfer your WhatsApp data from iOS to Android and Android to iOS with your finger trips by using the What's Go application. You can also spoof or change your GPS location to anywhere without jailbreaking your iOS and Android. As well as you can also bypass Samsung FRP log and remove Google and pin verification up to Android 12 and 13. Not just that, but you can also repair 200 plus iPhone problems at home like a pro without losing your data. And the best thing is that anyone can do that without the need of technical knowledge. By using this coupon code, which I have mentioned down below, you can avail 30% discount on WorldSco application, which will be ended in three days. So get your plane a 30% discount before it ends. The download link and the coupon code is mentioned down below in the description. Now you can simply download this application from its official site. I have already mentioned the link in the description. After downloading, install it at your desktop. And this is the main interface of i 2 labor School, which doesn't require any technical knowledge. It's very easy to use. For example, if you are transferring data from GB WhatsApp from Android to iPhone or iPhone to Android, simply click on this option. While in this video, I will be transferring WhatsApp data from Android to iPhone. So let me just click on the WhatsApp. Now you have to connect that phone from which you are transferring data and then the target phone to which you are transferring data. Now just follow these instructions which are very easy to do. First of all, you need to enable end-to-end -end encryption on your current device and then you have to make a backup which I am showing you how you can do that. Just make sure to take a screenshot of this code because it will be required in the next few steps. Then just click enable once you make a backup. Now you have to type that 64 digit key here. I know it would be a bit hard but we don't have any choice. Just click on verify. Now simply log in to a new device with the same number. After logging into the new device, just click on logged in and now it's transferring data to your new device. Just keep in mind if your backup is too much then it may take up to 20 minutes but obviously it depends on your WhatsApp data. In my case, it took me around 15 minutes because it was around 700 MB backup. And that's it, we have successfully transferred our data from Android to iPhone very easily without any technical knowledge. You can also transfer your WhatsApp data from iPhone to Android or iPhone to Android by following this method. You can blindly trust on WordsCo because it's one of the most trusted application out there. I will definitely recommend WordsCo if you are worried about your WhatsApp data and want to transfer because anyone can use this application and its paid versions are also very affordable. Make sure to purchase your plan at discounted prices which is very for limited time. Okay, so that's it. Let me know if you guys have any question in your mind regarding the WordSco application. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.